Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today I'm sharing a Christmas decor haul because I found so many cute things I thought I would share with you guys. Also, if you're not already, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you don't miss my Christmas clean and decorate with me, which is going live this Friday. But without further ado, let's just jump right into the decor. So I thought I would start out with the biggest item. It is this garland that's from Home Depot. I didn't want to take it out of the bag because I didn't want it leaving like little pieces all over Mateo's room. If you saw any of my videos around Christmas time last year, you probably would have seen that I had a garland around our front door and I really wanted to have one like that around our back door. So I got the same one. It's from Home Depot and I'm pretty sure it was like $19.99 or somewhere around there. So super affordable and it looks so cute around the door. The next thing I got was from Amazon. I will link it down below if I can find it because I can't remember what the name of the like store was off the top of my head. But it's this red knitted throw blanket and I got it to go on top of our bed or at the end of our bed because I have a pillow that you'll see in a minute that I got from Hobby Lobby and I wanted a blanket to kind of match it. But it almost looks um, like a bit darker than the pillow so I'm not quite sure if I'll keep it. I guess you'll find out in the Christmas clean and decorate with me. Moving on to Hobby Lobby, this is the pillow that I was talking about. It says Merry Everything and it's like a red knitted pillow. It's so soft, I love it. And I thought this would be so cute on our bed. I actually have never decorated too much with red, like traditional Christmas colors. I usually like a lot of white and like wintry kind of looks. But I was looking on Pinterest and I got super inspired. So I think I'm gonna incorporate more of these traditional Christmas colors this year. This also was originally $19.99, but they have a great sale right now at Hobby Lobby where all the Christmas decor is 50% off, so this actually ended up only being $10. The next thing I got from Hobby Lobby was this little cute box, at least I'm pretty sure that's what he is. But I got this to go in Mateo's room on his shelf. Um, if you saw my fall clean and decorate with me or just any cleaning videos, I guess, where I'm in Mateo's room, you probably saw that I have an orange box in here. And I thought that would be really cute to have more of like a wintry version <laughs> to go in his room. Then I got this cute little Christmas tree. I need to fix the string. I just need to tie it back in a bow. But this is going to go on my nightstand in our bedroom. I always kind of have a vision of how I want things to look. And I'm not going to lie, I sometimes even draw it out because I just get too excited. But yeah, I thought a little Christmas tree on a little Christmas tree on the bedside table would look really cute. The next thing I got is this cute little wreath. Hopefully you can see it a little better. Um, I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with it. I just saw it when I was getting the Christmas tree and then it ended up in my cart and came home with me. So I guess I'll just have to find a place for it somewhere. The next thing I got was this little white pom-pom garland. And I'm not quite sure if you can see, but there's little like gold flecks throughout it. I just thought it was so cute and I couldn't pass it up, but also when I was kind of planning out how I want my decor to look this year, I knew that I needed three different garlands. I want to have one over a bed, one in Mateo's room over his changing table, and then also I was thinking of putting one above Mateo's crib. So yeah, this is one of the ones that I got and I'm pretty sure this one's going to end up going over our bed. The next garland is super cute. It's this little red and white pom-pom garland. And this one I'm pretty sure is gonna be the one that goes over Mateo's crib. Yeah, I just thought it was so cute and I couldn't pass it up, especially with the 50% off. The next one I went to was Target and I was really shocked. Our Target always kind of is behind on decor or just they're slacking, I don't know. Um, I was really surprised though because ours actually had a bit of Christmas stuff out already. The first thing I got from Target was this two pack of hand towels for the bathroom and they say one says fa la 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 on it and the other is white with red stripes i just thought these were so cute and i'm also going to be getting the matching rug that says fa la la on it but i have to order it online because our target was out of stock the next couple things i got were from the dollar tree at target and the first thing is this little tiny tree um i think it was only a dollar at the dollar spot hopefully this is like focusing <laughs> I just thought this would look really cute on Mateo's shelf along with the little fox. Then I picked up two little packs of their window clings. They just have them for such a good price there. I always have to get them because Mateo and Annalie are obsessed with these kind of window clings. So I got one that has like foxes and snowflakes on it. And then I got one that says ho 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 and also has Santa on it. 
Also, these are the kind of things that I like to buy and tuck away for whenever the kids are really bored because especially Mateo, these entertain him for like an hour. He's so obsessed with window clings. There's also two other things from Target that I plan on getting. If I can find pictures of them, I will try and pop them up somewhere around here on the screen. But it's two signs. One says Merry Christmas and has a red border and the other is white and says blah 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 on it. I just have two spots in mind in my house that I think they would look perfect. So hopefully my dollar spot will get that soon. All right, so the next store I went to was Walmart and I only got two things from here, but I thought I would still include them. I got these LED lights and they're in the warm white light color. <laughs> and I really wanted some string lights like this to go around our garland above our kitchen sink. The next thing I got was this super cute Christmas wrapping paper. It's just so cute. It was only $4.98 and it has little polar bears and snowflakes all over it. The last store I went to was Big Lots and the first thing I got from there was this little truck garland. Um, it's got little white trucks with Christmas trees on the back. And I just thought this would be perfect for Mateo's room. He's obsessed with trucks. He actually was with me and he picked this one out. And yeah, it was only $6. And technically it's a tree garland. But I mean, it's still a garland. <laughs> it would fit. I think it'll fit perfectly above his changing table. That way he can kind of like look at it or play with it while I'm changing his diaper. The next thing I got was more window clings. Um, these ones have Mickey, Minnie, and Pluto on them. My kids are just so obsessed with Mickey and Minnie. Mateo is especially obsessed with Minnie. It's so cute. And he actually helped pick this one out as well. But yeah, it was only $5. And these are the kind of window cleans that I like because they're like that gel kind of material instead of the other ones because these will stick on the windows better. I also picked up two bags of bows. One that's got like white, silver, and kind of like a bronzy color. I'm not sure if that's the right word. <laughs> And then I also got another one that has black, red, and white. And I thought these would go really well because so far my Christmas wrapping paper is kind of just black and white. I, I don't know how that happened. <laughs> and the last thing I got was this wrapping paper in the buffalo check or buffalo plaid. I can't remember what it's called. I just thought it was so cute. It was only $3.50. I mean, it is only 45 square feet, but it's so cute. I just couldn't pass it up. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not really sure how all my Christmas wrapping paper so far has been black and white. That wasn't really the theme I was going for. Usually I try and match my wrapping paper to like the ornaments on the tree a little bit, but I mean black and white goes with everything, so. But yeah, that's all the new Christmas decor I got this year. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you on my next video. Bye guys! Like I'm better off.